Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Photopea tutorial. And this one, I'm be showing you guys how you can make a really cool wallpaper that is based off of your YouTube or whatever. It's suited towards you, essentially. So I'm gonna show you guys how to make something like my thumbnail right here. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so before we get started, we're going to need to figure out your display resolution. So right click on your desktop, go to display settings, scroll down until you see display resolution, and it should be the recommended one. So mine's 1920 by 1080. So whatever yours is, is what we'll be using for the dimensions. So you can close that. Now you can go up to file new and type in that resolution that you just saw. Not mine, but whatever yours is and hit create. So now this is the size of our display so we can get started. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the background color to a dark blue, like about right here. Now I'm just gonna hit okay. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over here to our pen tool right here, click on that. Now we're just gonna click right here, right here. And now we can adjust it however we'd like so like this kind of what I'm going for you can make whatever shape you want I don't know this kind of has a cool look to it so you just gotta mess with it I mean like it's kind of confusing I just click keep clicking and then I like grab a point and it kind of messes up sometimes because I'm not doing it right but there's different ways you can do it. You just hold down left click and you can form different shapes and stuff. So you might have to mess with that. But this is just going to be a simple tutorial. So now I'm just going to type something like Cambit like this. And I'm going to change the color to white. Change the size to about 200. We'll see how big that is. That's good. And change the font. I'm going to go with my font. My classic font. Lemon milk. Hit that check mark. Now I'm going to move it somewhere about right here. I'm going to hit control J to duplicate my text layer and I'm just going to move it down. But this time change the size to like 57 to start. So you could put like, um, what you do like YouTuber slash graphic designer. So like something like that. And then what you want to do is you just want to adjust the size. So you can just put it right below it. And if you go up to edit and free transform and hold shift while you do it, you can adjust it like this until you get what you want. I think I need to move it down a little more like this. So that looks pretty good. If you want to change the color of this right here, just double click on it, go to color overlay and you can choose whatever color you'd like. I'm going to go with like orange because it's a complementary color of blue, which I have right here in the background and hit OK. So this is all it takes. It's super simple. You could also use this for like a Twitch starting soon screen or a be right back screen. It's super easy, but it's simple and I like that. So you can try adding some drop shadow to this if you want, but I'm not sure how that would look. So you can try adding a drop shadow like this so it really separates itself from the background but that's up to you guys i think it looks pretty good with one um but this is all it takes and now you just want to go up to file export as png save and then to change your wallpaper you go to you right click on your desktop go to personalize and hit browse until you find the project you just made. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.